Hello again there, you two fans. This is the real creepy doll man here. I'm back with an all new episode, but this is not a normal episode or a double episode. This is a triple episode. So that means the real creepy doll man is going to work three times as hard for all you two fans. No, you die hard real creepy doll man fans from around the world. Okay. This marks the second anniversary of Daisy, the haunted doll, and Ted, the haunted teddy bear. Both of these siblings, meaning both brother and sister, made their first big debut here on YouTube together on August the 7th of 2017. By their owner, the real creepy doll man, brought them here as an exclusive for all the YouTube fans and all you Daho Real Creepy Doll Man fans to see. In our communications and in our investigations with both me and the real Creepy Ghost Hunter Jr., we found the name of both of these two spirits of these siblings that are tied both to the female porcelain doll and this little female teddy bear. Okay, the female first will give you the name of her. Her name is Daisy. Now, Daisy didn't have a last name, so the last name is unknown at this very time. Now, there is a male spirit attached to the teddy bear, of this female teddy bear. His name is Ted. And Ted is actually both related to Daisy, and Daisy is related to Ted. They are both brother and sister, both siblings. Now, we investigate further. We found out that the female communicate more with us in this interview. Now, she was the one that gave us full description of both her and how her brother was. So both the siblings, you know, were totally different. Now, sad to say that both these siblings gave us very little detail how they lived their life just before they both died. But the one that did the most communicating with us was actually the sister, Daisy. So Daisy told us their age together. Daisy is a teenage girl, age uh, 16 years old. And she said that her brother, Ted, is actually a little boy, 8 years old. Sad to say, tragedy came for both these siblings. But not one died the same way. They both died separately and not at the same time. Daisy gave us a puzzle that her brother died. He was killed by a satanic cult or devil worshippers is what you want to call them today. And she gave us graphic details as she hid herself from this devil worshipper cult and was the smart one to hide as she gruesomely watched her brother getting killed and beheaded by what we don't know was it an axe, a large knife, or a sword, we do not know. But little Ted died at the age of eight years old, month and day, unknown. But after that, after Daisy told us that she hid from the devil worshippers and she was attacked and did get away scot-free and lived to tell the tale a few months or a few years later she had died in a plane crash at the age of 16 years old and lost her life at a young age and we don't know the month the day or the year when she died so all that will be unknown on both of them on when they died separately. So we have no clue what the month, day, and the year on both of them when they died. So that remains a mystery. But we will communicate down the road in the future with both of them. And hopefully we can go back and communicate with them again. Maybe on record or off record. And I apologize to all the fans out there. That this was supposed to be the double episode, but I slipped them in the triple episode instead because I forgot their anniversary came too today, the same time Queen did. So I'm sorry and apologize to all the fans out there. Now I send a message out there. A parent advisory has been issued to all parents who 
If you have any children that wants to watch this episode, they must get their parents' permission first due to the graphic nature of murder and violence. Now I say this, keep watching more to come, and this is the real Creepy Doll Man sent to all the fans out there. Goodbye, and God bless you all.